What's up, everybody? Welcome to Podcast Now Plus. I'm Alex, and in this video, I want to talk about a rumor of what Quantic Dream Star Wars game is, and then we will talk about it. Very simple, very easy rumor. This comes from Jeff Grubb, and he does say that this should be specified as a rumor. This is not like a you know 100% thing. The setting for Quantic Dreams, the Star Wars game, is the High Republic era. Seems like this is part of Disney's push to make this time period a thing, only a few hundred years before the uh, original trilogy, unlike the Old Republic. I believe it's 200 years before Episode One. So, you know, I, actually, well, I guess technically uh, that is right. And the name is Star Wars Eclipse. So, again, rumor, not, you know, not a confirmed thing, and that's kind of it. So, look, I... I don't know too much about the High Republic era, okay? It would be wrong for me to just come out there and say, you know, all of these very bold <laughs> comments if I, uh, you know, especially if I don't really know too much of what I'm talking about. But a few things. Number one, I have been pretty supportive of the idea of this project since we heard about it just because I do I do like Quantic Dream. Um, I think Heavy Rain is a phenomenal, phenomenal game. I love Detroit Become Human. I think they absolutely nailed that. Beyond had some problems but I actually did overall kind of enjoy that one too it's not nearly as good as the other two but you know I I like the studio and I like what they're able to do in terms of the branches you know branching off and uh you know all these different ways of you know ha having something play out I think that would work really really well with a Star Wars game so I like the idea or I liked the idea I will say though from everything that I had seen leading up to the High Republic era not impressed not happy couldn't I well I would say couldn't care less, but I guess I do care, right, in a way, and it's also Star Wars, but it's just a complete, I guess, un like, non-interest for me, and I also feel like you could just do better than using the High Republic. With that being said, we would all be very, very stupid, I'd be very, very stupid, to assume that these guys were going to, you know, still, actually, exactly like Jeff Grubb said, you know, you, you have this book, you have this series, right? And uh, I don't, I try to watch a couple of reviews on it. It doesn't seem like people love it all that much, especially when you go into comments and, and like to dislike and all that stuff. It doesn't seem like people are very, you know, maybe there's people that do like it, but I don't really get the sense that it's like the greatest thing ever. It's definitely not as good as the Old Republic from what I have kind of gathered as well. So I just feel like, there's better, <laughs> better things to do, or better, uh, you know, time periods, settings, places, whatever, uh, to do rather than you know do this. But I, I don't know. I, again, it's I don't want to go too far with that because you know I myself am not you know that well educated on it, and I also don't know what Quantic Dream would do with the idea. You know what I mean? I mean, give me, give me a Jedi. I don't know, like, customization is probably not something, you know, I mean, like, this is not Knights of the Old Republic, obviously, like, so this would be, you know, you have maybe a, a select few characters, I mean, that is kind of their MO, right, they, they lost that a little bit with Beyond, because you're just playing as, you know, the central character, but, you know, for Heavy Rain and uh, Detroit, you're playing as, like, a, a wide, you know, a wide cast, so give me, you know, two to five characters, have them be a little bit different. Maybe they interact, or I, well, I think they would have to, right? They have to intersect with each other at some time, and uh, you know, maybe I, I, don't, I really don't even know what to say. You know, beyond that, I'm not very high on the High Republic, and that is uh, truly no pun intended. So let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Maybe you guys have read, you know, some of it, or maybe you haven't, but let me know your thoughts in the comments. As always, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel, hit the bell icon so you guys know when all of these videos go up. I do a brand new video on the channel. Every every single day and so hope to see you guys for tomorrow's video.